Hello everybody, this is Nick speaking. Welcome back to another episode of Planet Coaster here in Desert Valley. In the last episode, we did a little bit of, uh, you know, trying to make stuff a little bit more cohesive, filling in some few small gaps and that. Um, mainly because I didn't have much time to record last episode, however, uh, this one should be a little bit better. Um, so, at the end of the last episode, I did do a little poll. Um, asking what you would like to see over in this area over here and looked like basically everybody was thinking the um, waterside promenade sort of thing would work so basically the idea is I'm gonna kind of drop a lower sort of deck here that comes right up next to this one this will come back a little bit and then I think we are going to do the ride over here on the other side, just because I think that will be a little bit, give a little bit of interest to this area and do kind of different things for it. So um, the idea I was playing with would be like maybe some sort of like the teacups ride was my main idea. So the thing I would want to do is actually sink it back into the cliff face kind of like this. And then it just kind of pokes out a little bit. Kind of like this is right here almost. So, yeah, so I think that will probably be the spot we end up placing it in. Um, I'm not going to have it flat. Oh, okay, apparently you have to have it flat in terrain. Um, okay, so if we put you in. Yep, that gives us a little bit of a space in there. So we get our actual teacups right in. Now, because of where it's located, it's kind of dark back in there. Um, hmm. It'd be kind of a cool little spot back there. I do like the idea of doing that. Maybe you just have, like, the exit path come, like, down here or something. Uh, we'll see. But, anyways, we know this, these whole, this rock work over here is gonna have to go... Bye. So, bye-bye. There go a whole bunch of rocks. Here go some more rocks. There we go. So basically, I want to just clear out as much of this as possible so we have a good surface to work with over here, basically. There we go. And so the thing will be is we're going to do kind of two sort of levels over here. So... One is going to basically, like, match up to the water almost perfectly, so, yeah, like, almost perfect. Might actually have to come up just a tiny bit. There we go. There we go, just so that way we don't actually intersect the water itself. And that will be the lower deck, and we'll just kind of do that. So, playing with height here is always kind of a cool little thing to do. And then, so we have this kind of lower deck area here, which will be all the way down the side. And then we have the upper deck here, which is the path that's already in place. Now, let's do the disjoin thing here. So now the idea is I kind of want to hug this as close as possible. And... It ends up should be, work out pretty well. Nope, that one's a little too far over. Um, okay, for some reason we're running into a little bit of a problem here. Yeah, let's do that then. That bump doesn't like me apparently, is what's going on actually. There we go, okay, that works. And then we just kind of will have a thing here, and this will be a... Oh, if I could tell it to, it would be a staircase, maybe. There we go, and just kind of like that. Yeah, except for the whole... These paths don't want to go down a cliff like this. That is a thing that is going to be a problem very easily. So if I do something like that and then 
like that and like that. If we delete these, and then we go back in, this should flatten it. So if we go like that, we delete you and you. Now you should be able to go down like this. There we go. See, except for that doesn't look right, so... Ah, huh. I like the idea of doing this lower area, but it might not be as easy as it looks. So, you know what? I'm gonna do it, and we'll come back in just a little bit. Okay, so we are back, and as you can probably see here, I mean, I did get this sort of water-facing area in here. Now, as you probably have guessed, this is not its final form, so yeah, now it's, you know, kind of time to go ahead and make this area actually look somewhat nice. Um, I mean, like, we have some areas here, like, this is an awkward transition between the actual path path and the wooden part here. Um, we've also got Kind of like a weird sort of bankment here. We need some rocks back over here. So I think that will be the next thing I tackle here. So let's get going on that. Um, I think I might actually do it in a little bit of a time lapse part here. So yeah. Um, yeah. So yeah, I think let's get going with the time lapse. You should be, uh, we'll bring up the music a little bit here and let's get going.
Okay, so we are back, everybody, and yeah, that last clip was recorded back in the middle of August, so, um, so yeah, I don't, I'm sure you guys have probably figured out by now, but there has been a long time since, um, this actually came out, in contrast to what has been said earlier in this episode, because somebody ended up getting sick for like about, oh, I don't know, about a month or maybe a little bit more than that, so yeah, that's, you know, kind of annoying, um, and I've really not been up to recording anything since then, so yeah, the time lapse was literally the last thing that's been recorded, but anyways, I did do just a little bit of extra over here, kind of, you know, bringing, like, boats in, some piers, and adding some benches, although, just remember, nobody's gonna actually use this down here, so yeah. Well, it's something that's like, okay, we should probably have that here. It's not getting used whatsoever, so... Yeah, so... That was the main thing I wanted to get done this episode, but... It's not the only thing that's happening this episode. I will say, the, um... Spooky Halloween pack thing has come out, and I do have it, so... Yeah... That's probably going to be, like, the prob something that gets added in, maybe in its own little section or something, kind of like doing, what, like, a haunted house or something sort of thing. Um, not really right now, because I don't really have the plan ready to go for it yet, but that's one of the things that I will be adding in at some point. I also need to do these billboard screens, because... Yeah, they're not done yet, either. Other than the, that, I mean, for the most part, we are doing pretty well in progress for this area, so I am rather glad about that, but, um, yeah, so, like I said, that was the main project for this episode. I don't think I'm gonna do the whole, um, adding a ride on this side just because this is already starting to feel kind of cramped and for me to get a ride in here I'd have to take out some of this land add it in and then find some way to actually get a path over to it which is probably a lot harder than it would need to be so yeah I don't think it's actually doable over here so I'm just not gonna do it. We'll just have, like, these two rights over here on this side of things, which should be fine. And we'll probably, for next episode, focus our efforts into here, into this little section. Just so we're kind of, you know, continuing the loop around. And then this is gonna be a new... kind of sort of theme area, I guess, again, over here. So... So this area here, and this little bit right in here, and then the, this area in here will be a separate theme as well. So that's kind of the idea here. So any, the only thing about it is this theme and this theme will kind of need to go together since they're open to one another. This one is a lot more closed off, so this one we can probably get away with doing a lot more back over in this side. Um, so yeah, I don't know, like, what these things are gonna be really just yet. I was thinking about what I want to do, but it's just, you know, I'm thinking probably one of them will have, like, the some of the elements for the spooky theme set, so... Part of the plan is that I was going to do, like, some sort of, like, this will be, like, some sort of, like, a whole building area, so there will be a few buildings in this area over here, um, and then over in this little area we'll have, like, a spot in there, too. Almost thinking, like, this area would be kind of, like, a cool 
maybe almost like a sci-fi area. It's kind of closed off from the rest of the park. You just have like a few trees up on the top here and other than that, I mean, it's like literally just closed off from everything. There's also the whole idea of, well, there would, that we, I would like to put a backstory to this, but, uh, well, the way this park is going, I don't think there's going to be much of a spot to do that, so, yeah, we've got a little while left to go here, um, yeah, I kind of figured I would be a lot further along with this park by now than I am, but, Apparently, it just takes a long time to do these sort of things, so yeah, that's just how it is, and that's sometimes what you end up with, so. But anyways, I think we are running out of time for this episode, um, so if you did enjoy, please make sure to uh, hit the like button, and leave comments below on what you would like to see for the series going forward. I really don't want to abandon this project because, again, it is one thing that I do enjoy. It's just, it's kind of a project that was a lot larger than I probably should have tackled so early on, and especially with this being like an old alpha park, the, like, we have the whole, um, entrance thing that's kind of, like, whatever, and I can't do anything with it, and, yeah, so, it's a mess, um, yeah, that's one of the downsides to all of this is the lack of being able to customize this area, so... Other than that, thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye!